Star Deck 100. Very interesting product, Japan. I know you're catering to the TCG players, but you've included some interesting cards for us collectors. Yes, you know what I'm talking about. There's a hundred different decks, but there's also something called a God Deck. That's Deck 101. And that's going to contain five secret rares out of the eight in total from this whole entire set. But the God deck is specifically going to have a full art Marnie, a full art Barry. If you don't know who Barry is, he's your rival in Diamond and Pearl. And the three Galarian legendary birds in gold form. It's interesting how they're not shiny, but they're there. So I'm excited about that. I don't even care about the Marnie or the Barry. Guys, I'm not a simp. I'm a woman. I want the birds. So that's what I'm really after in this video. But also in other news, there's also three other full arts you can pull. There's a Pikachu V, a Granbull V, and also Zamazenta V full art. Beautiful cards. However, I do not know what decks they're in. All I know is that there's a God deck, number 101. And also you can pull full art Marnie also in deck 96. Just one secret rare though. So who knows what else we can pull. I've seen people open cases of these, meaning like 10 decks, and they haven't even pulled one full art. So if you were to ask me if this is worth it, most likely not. But because... Me, I really want those birds. I'm gonna give it a chance to see if I can pull any of the gold cards in this video. Psst, psst, can I get your full attention? Don't forget, there is a discount code, Krista Collects, where you can get 5% off your order. So if you'd like to get your own Start Deck 100, feel free to take a look at the link in the description below. 5% off up until December 26, only for trading cards. And yes, I do ship worldwide via UPS. So before we get started, please be sure to hit that like button and also subscribe for more multi-language Pokemon content. Let's get started. All right, so one thing I forgot to mention in the intro, I actually have two decks. I'm not trying to buy a whole case because I don't want a case of bulk, but I do want to try my chances at getting the three legendary birds. And not only that, if you haven't noticed, I have two beautiful new cameras. So you get to watch me in 4K, but you also get to listen to Jay in 4K <laughs> with his British accent, whether you like it or not. So before we get started, let's get going, guys. I'm so excited. Take a look at that. Also, if you didn't notice already, it's actually pretty small. Like, this is my hand. I have a very, very small hand, if you haven't noticed. So this is honestly, like, I guess regular size to my perspective. But if you have bigger hands than I do, this is going to be like a little pebble in your hand. So let's see what this is. I'm not going to show the number of the deck. I'm going to actually, oh, yeah. you know, going to just go through it <laughs> first so we don't do any, you know, spoil anything. Oh. <laughs> I just ripped through it. I didn't realize there was a sticker on the side, so... <laughs> I'm just destroying the cover. So here's the damage counters. Wow. Oh, that's so cute. It's like a little like board. So very uh, a lot uh, thinner compared to other damage counters I've seen in other decks. I mean, the deck is only yay thick, so it has to be thin. And plus we have like 60 cards and whatnot. QR code. I don't know what this is for. Looks like it's about learning the TCG. Hence, you know, this whole product line. Okay, so I mean, from the get-go, this is probably not the god deck. All the cards are mirror hollow foil, but hey, let's see what happens, right? Okay, this is always tricky to open, but let's get this out. Okay, now we got this out. <laughs> that was a bit of a battle, but let's go through this, you know, slowly. We only have two decks, so we can enjoy the cards. Beautiful Ultra Ball artwork, by the way. You're going to have a few of them. Of course, this is a deck pre-constructed deck with a lot of useful supporter cards. We even got a great ball. I do not know which deck this one is, but I'll show you guys a few of the first few ones. We got Energy Switch. Oh, we got Shauna in this one. Again, they're all going to be different. We got the Coach. We got Barry or Rival. I already see some of the V cards that are not going to be hollow. That's pretty typical of decks. Um, I remember when they released decks early on, I think 2020, it was like nine different types of Pokemon and none of the V cards were hollow. <gasps> oh, I'm actually really happy about this. We have Espeon V and Umbreon V. Interestingly enough, not holographic. So also one other type of deck I'd like to get eventually, if I'm lucky enough, are the legendary dogs or beasts. I know some people might argue they're not dogs. We got Staryu by Yukamori. She had a really cool post actually on Instagram where she actually held the Staryu clay model. So, so cute. It's actually a lot bigger. It looks tiny here. But yeah, that's an interesting fact. Beautiful Starmie. This art style is so nice by Komayama. It looks very cartoonish with the lovely like sunlight there. So I'm going to take my time admiring these cards because we you know, only have two decks. So some Minecraft looking impotent, but it just looks very like cubicle. Very interesting art style for sure. Morgrim. Ooh, I like this perspective of Morgrim. Looks very sneaky. So lots of dark type Pokemon and random water Pokemon as well. We have three different types. <laughs> we have Grimmsnarl. Oh, of course, the colorless. We have Stantler. Very lovely. I feel like we've seen that before. Escape Rope. More um, useful supporters, trainers, more great ball, very haphazardly <laughs> arranged. Pokeball, more Shauna, and very lovely energy cards. So these aren't mirror hollow, but I like the design of them. So they're psychic and dark type. And then we have number 
58 okay so and you can even see the typings on the bottom right corner to know which type of deck you have so of course again guys just to repeat this is meant for tcg players it's not meant to be for collectors but of course they're going to make it interesting enough for everyone to buy it so deck number two okay i'm going to be smart this time and actually cut the tape i was a little dumb last time <laughs> but let's let's cut through that that'll make my life a lot easier and there's Rayquaza, there's Rayquaza here, there's Rayquaza here. You guys know I love Rayquaza already, even have a plush in the back, but we're not going to feature him in this video because we don't even know if we're going to pull a Rayquaza. Okay, once again, more damage counters, advertisement. Uh, all right, I guess my luck isn't really with me today, but what did I expect? It was worth a shot. It was going to be fun, so let's go ahead and rip this open. All right, there you go. That wasn't too bad that time. Had some practice for the first one. So one more Ultra Ball, beautiful Ultra Ball. Uh, I don't really know what else to say about it. Oh, wow, okay. Oh, look at this. So we have a mirror foil flare. We're getting a lot of evolutions now. The evolutions want to show me love. So <laughs> we have that. Oh, and a Apollo Metagross. I'm guessing this is a fire and steel type deck. Okay, I guess I'll just leave that up. Oh, and a mirror hollow of nine tails. So the weird thing about some of these decks, not everything's going to be mirror hollow except the god deck, of course. But some decks are just going to have like randomly assorted mirror foil and non mirror foil like obviously barry here is not mirror foil but the v cards are which is nice you're not going to get your typical hollow foil like for typical sets but you're going to have some interesting mirror foil like a lot of fire type pokemon macargo volpix slugma etc oh galarian meow it's really cute so some steel types galarian persecur cobalion which is not holographic i'm used to seeing this as a hollow card oh klefki the steel fairy type pokemon a little creepy but really cute at the same time more energy switch more trainer cards supporter cards more shauna really interesting if they somehow would just put a full out in there but not gonna happen and zinnia wow like one random zinnia card not not upset about that we have fire type and metal type so i get four different energies in this new printing pattern and what deck number is this 73 just in case you were really interested in getting a flareon and a metagross deck with hollow foil so there's our two decks guys i hope you found that somewhat educational again if you wanted your own japanese pokemon products be sure to check out yoyakinow.com where you can use discount code cresta collects for a five percent off your order up until December 26th and only for trading cards. So we'll see you guys in the next video. Stay safe and take care.